Welcome back, Collective. Let's get straight to your reading. Collective energy, please and thank you, Spirit. Messages for the Collective. Strength. Hmm. Someone gave the wrong advice. So two people are no longer talking. Two masculines are no longer talking, no longer communicating. One masculine is telling the other masculine, I want nothing to do with you. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to deal with you. That's it. Closing out a cycle. Two masculines. They're being blunt. They're like, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want nothing to do with you. Somebody is calling them out, calling them immature. Let's see what this is saying. Talk to me about this. Accusations. <laughs> this is a friend. Maybe a friend of yours is talking to your person. They don't trust this friend anymore. This masculine is talking to this masculine and they're saying I don't want to talk to you anymore. I don't want nothing to do with you. Um, you're a friend. I don't trust your friendship anymore. I don't trust you. After what you did to the collective energy, I don't trust you anymore. So there's a masculine who's turning on another masculine here, saying, I, I don't trust you. I don't trust you. If your person got married to somebody or is living with somebody or in a relationship with somebody, they're losing their friends. There is a masculine calling your masculine out and or vice versa. Take it as it resonates. There is one like a feminine could be in their masculine energy. But this is masculine energy telling off another masculine. Saying, I don't trust you. I don't want nothing to do with you. Keep them away from me. This is who they're involved with. They're like, keep them away from me. I don't trust them. Oh, they're like, yeah, P 
people are talking about your person at work. They don't want nothing to do with this new person. This masculine don't want, want nothing to do with your person's person. Nothing. They're like, they're... Yeah. Because they juggled you. Someone is sticking up for you. Someone's defending you. Someone is saying you juggled them. What, what are you lying about? They're confronting this other masculine. Said, what are you lying about? I know what went on. I know who the collective energy is. They're calling them out on their bullshit. <laughs> They're not. They don't. <laughs> they know what went down. This person, I don't know who they are, but they know what went down. And they're like, you juggled them. They know the story on your person. Oh, yeah, they're worried. <laughs> they're embarrassed. Maybe that's that shocking news that came out. Like... It's, they know damn well, they're getting called out on their bullshit. Yes, they are. A friend of theirs has turned on them. Because of what they found out, this masculine, it was shook. This is the one that got shook. When they found out what this person did to you. Freaking rights. Making fun of this emperor. Calling him a, a, a liar and a cheat and a player that's why your person shook somebody called their ass out on you on your behalf they're like you're full of shit you've been accusing them but I know what you've been doing I was there I know I work with you I've been dealing with you long it's a friend of theirs calling them out you're a cheater you're a player. So why are you accusing the collective energy when it's the truth? Why are you calling the collective out when you know damn well it's they're telling the truth? You're over there minding your own business. This person respects you. This person respects you. Admires you. So this person could be a friend of your person's. And they are calling them out. They, they're calling them straight up at a liar. They're saying, I know damn well you're lying. I know you're a cheat. I know you cheated on them. Who are you trying to kid here? You're not getting anything over on me. I know you. I know you cheated. I know you have a history of cheating. I know the collective energy was respectable. They're calling him out. Jesus. Mm-hmm. They are saying this third party caused, wished to cause a tower for the collective. Somebody is, 
setting the record straight here, guys. This is a friend. Either your friend, a friend of yours, or a friend of theirs. They are setting the record straight. They are calling their ass out. And they're saying you're full of shit. I know you cheated. Remember, I was your friend? Why are you now turning around and blaming the collective energy for what you did? They have drawn the line here. You've crossed the line. I don't want nothing to do with you. You're a liar, you're a player, and you're a cheat. And you did this collective dirty, and I don't want nothing to do with you. Shock. Shock. They know you were telling the truth. They know why this situation ended. Told you, truth's coming out. This person's angry about it. You've been telling the truth all along. This person is saying the collective has been the only honest person here been telling the truth all along and they're angry about this masculine speaking up for you they're shook they're like what tables are turning this could be a family member they're like i, I, I don't want nothing to do with you So it's like you're a fool. You should have kept your soulmate. You should have gone toward your soulmate. And you should have committed to them. Uh-huh. going to look a long time before you find someone this dedicated, this hard working, and this trusted and balanced. Should have committed to them. Why'd you lead them on then? They're like, why'd you leave them? Why did you lead them on? Why did... So other people are calling them out on the same thing. Why'd you leave them on? Why'd you tell them you were going to marry them? Why did you tell them you were committed to them then? Why did you tell them that you made all these promises to them? You were manipulating them. Ghosting them so you could be happy. You broke someone's heart. Are you happy now you hurt them? That's what they're saying. Are you happy now that they're hurt? Are you happy you hurt them? Are you happy you manipulated them? Whoa. I don't know who this masculine is. But they ain't pulling no punches with your person. Your person's shook. They're getting your, they're getting their ass called out. They could have defended you. This person could have defended you when this person was making accusations about you. Somebody knows you're doing well for yourself. Somebody's keeping an eye on you and is seeing you're doing really financially good for yourself. So it's making them all look like liars. It's like you're independent. 
You've got your own money. You're paying your own bills. You're paying your own way. This person could have said they were giving you money. This person's calling their ass out on it. Said you should have given them money. You should have given them money. You should have helped them out. You should have contributed. Hmm. Stressing them out, being arrogant. Someone's, they're fighting over you. They're fighting over you. Someone is definitely sticking it to your person. They're like, you should have helped them out. You should have been generous. You should have helped them out. You should have contributed. You should have done this. Now, don't turn around and accuse them to me because... They know about you. They either know you or they know about you. This is that powerful friend. They're like, I don't know who you think you're kidding, but you're not fooling anyone here. And how dare you come and accuse the collective of these things when you know damn well it was you. Oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah. You should have made things right. Yeah. Too busy. Just leave it him out in the cold. This person's ashamed of this person. They're ashamed of them. And it has your person shook. This person is defending you, going way out of their way to do so. They are calling them out. They're not listening to their bullshit and their accusations. They're like, bullshit. Thank you to whoever you are who is doing this. Thank you. You needed this support. They're your supporter now. Whoever this person is, they are your supporter. And your person's angry about it. Because you're over here now, whatever stories they've been making up about you, saying this or saying that, you're doing very well financially. And even if you weren't, you're looking after yourself. You're not who they accused you of being. This person's saying you should have helped them out. Well, if they weren't doing well, uh, why weren't you helping them? If you if you think that they were broke or you think that they weren't financially well off, why the fuck didn't you help them? Someone is, they're not getting a word in edgewise. This person's ready to fight this person. There's nothing that this person can say that this person cannot back up and defend. They're like, well, you know, they were broke or they didn't have much money. Well, this person's like, then why in the hell didn't you help them out? Why didn't you help them? If they were that way. And you supposedly loved them. And you supposedly were committed. And you were supposedly this. 
Why didn't you turn around then and help them out? It's like you did everything alone. You were doing everything alone. This person knows it. And they're not backing down. Your person is shook because this person apparently has said how well you are doing, what you're acquiring, what you're getting. And this person's shook. They've been called out on their bullshit. Not only have they been called out on their bullshit, but they get to find out how well you're doing. They're shook. So all the stories that they were making up about you have backfired. The lies they told. Take care.